Back in 1999, the first true open world game ever released came out. A little game called Outcast. Fast forward all the way to 2024, we have finally received its sequel, Outcast A New Beginning. The first game got raving reviews across the world. Tens of thousands of people played it. So with all that hype around the first game, I'm really curious if this new game lives up to that hype. Let me know if you happen to have played the first game before, and let me know if you think this game is worth it. Hit that sub button and smash the like, let's get started. I'm excited to kind of dive deeper into this game. As just a quick explanation of the story thus far, I am essentially chosen by the gods. Oh god. Oh! I've been chosen by the gods. Oh! Overheating, not good. Okay, as I was saying before I was rudely interrupted by the local for, uh, flora and fauna. I don't know if those are flora or fauna. They look like plants, but they shot spit at me. I've been chosen by the gods to essentially repair relations between all of the aliens on this planet. But on top of that, there's a problem. Humans just like me are running rampant over here trying to mine and steal all of the resources from this planet. Essentially making the aliens that live here completely extinct. Essentially, my job is to save them, kill everything, and essentially make the villages happy enough so they can start procreating again and start uh, bringing the population up, because... The turmoil and the politics of the planet are no bueno at the moment. I want to gather the resources that these guys drop. This will allow me to upgrade my weapons, my booster packs, resources that I keep picking up around the planet and killing all the enemies and fighting robots and humans and all this other crazy stuff is slowly just going to keep upgrading our character amongst our wildest dreams. So let's pick an objective and let's go do it, yeah? So it looks like we have a Gork Eruption over here. Difficulty level one. Sure, let's go give that a try. I have this kind of jetpack sprint. This is amazing. Whee! Oh, we want to mine all of these resources, though. These are all going to be crafting supplies for our upgrades in the future. Gonna help me get to where I'm going. What's going on in this little village here? Curious. I hear something glowing inside? Ooh! What's that gonna be? Give me that. Module parts. Find and collect module parts and bring them to Mazum, the Herit Shack, to, to get new modules. Okay. So it's like a world collectible. Oh, is this like a little farming village, little outcrop. But it looks like they're having an issue at the top of their permaculture right here. You're approaching a gork eruption. What is a gork eruption? A, a what now? Ew! 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 You don't get these kind of calls sitting behind the desk. Don't, don't like that. Gork has been erupting from the depths Ew. of Adelpha. It started with the invasion. Not good. Some kind of natural defense mechanism Not good. Creepy aliens. Do we gotta break this thing? I'm just gonna melee it. I'm going to try to play my height against these guys if I can. We should be good, though. Is there any more of those things I need to punch? Do I got to punch the middle one? Might just have to kill waves of them, maybe? Where are they? I don't see them through all this dust. Oh, there's one behind me. Minimap. There we go. And one of them jumped down here? Nope, we're all good. We just kill it now? Still says there's an enemy down here. There you go. You're not getting away, you little sneaky bugger. Oh god, more. Not good. Is that it? They all dead? This thing's still spawning? Oh, okay. It takes quite a few hits. Ugh! Uh, gotta heal. All right, down and out for the count. There we go. Grab that. To help with our crafting. And now do we melee this? Oh, there we go. Sure what this is, but it looks nice. Look how beautiful this game is. Holy crap! All right. And since this is an open world game, guess what we're gonna do next? Whatever we damn well please. There's a core outpost. We're gonna fight some of the. Uh, robot alien humans that are invading the planet. I think I'm gonna go do that real quick. 
And these outposts are gonna have weapon upgrades for us, which is something that I really want. Give a little scooch this way. And then this looks like the base that I'm supposed to take out. Oh, and they see me already. This game is all loud and proud, baby. There's no stealth. Don't need stealth where we're going. Just gonna block a few of those and then get up there. My aim is not exactly where I want it to be. Block those. Block that, and then hit you, and slice you in half, please. Thank you. Goodbye. And a lot of these rare purple materials that are really good for upgrades. And usually, these places will give me some goodies. But it looks like the goodies have been stolen already. Who took the goodies? God damn it. it looks like there's more goodies over here. Let's go get more goodies. I gotta pick up all these little plants. These are my current healing. I think we're gonna get some better healing in the future, but right now we have to eat blue plants for be for, for our heals. Ooh, a little mushroom guy. I haven't found one of these before. Valuable items. Oh, so we can sell those to traders. There's traders at every major camp. Oh, God. Only one of those? Thank the Lord. Let's go to our next objective. This is insane. I don't know what that big giant blue portal is, but it's got to be important. That might be the main shield around the village of the uh, chief of the aliens that live here. Pretty sure. Got some things up ahead. What spotted? Oh, some evil birds. We're all good, though. There's another evil bird. See you later, bud. And I think we're assaulting this tower here. I'm full. Oh, we're out of heals. I'm just gonna use one and grab it. There we go. Music reminds me a lot of Star Wars. It has the story of Avatar slash Pocahontas. There's a sniper up there. That's not good. Okay. I'm gonna have to try to play this up close and personal. What is this thing? Oh, don't mind if I do. Some more materials. Okay, looks like we're gonna have to land... Oh, God. We're gonna have to land, like, a double jump here. There we go. I got up. What up, dude? Nothing's gonna save you now, mother truckers. Goodbye. Give me all of your goodies. This is why I've come here. Ooh, new weapon module. You just collected nano cells. That's the purple stuff we were just talking about. Okay, and then this gives us more module slots. We can unlock one more module slot. So then right here we hold X, and then we can add the concussive blast. Look at the weapon change when I put that on. So this is like a good wombo combo for the pistol here. So it shoots a little slower, but it shoots harder now. It has pretty manageable recoil, so I'm not worried about that. And this is what we need to clear to upgrade our weapons, so... I think we're down and out for the count up here. See you later, sniper. What the hell is that? Look at that pudgy man! I'm gonna go see the pudgy man. Let me out. Oh, there was an elevator in the center. Does that go down or only up? It looks like it only goes down. Or up. Maybe I'm just stupid. Pudgy man! Pudgy dude! Hello! Look at you! A bon bar. He's impervious to my weaponry. Okay. I just had to try. Maybe we could eat them or something? But I guess not. Where to next? More weapon upgrades over here. Or if we do one more gork... ...interruption, we're gonna get a nice upgrade as well. Ew, look at those things! Disgusting. This one's down on a beach. Look at this place. Oh, that's a lot. Oh, gosh. I don't like that. Our damage is so much better, though. After clearing that tower. Here we go. We need to melee these things, right? Pretty sure. Hit it a couple of times. Here we go. 
Disgusting. I don't like it. I don't like it one bit. There we go. Grab that. Is it all cleared out now? There's another burrow somewhere, it says. There it is. Every hit we hit on this thing, more things are going to spawn. There we go. One more hit. Clear out all the aliens. And now break the center. There we go. That's two of two, so now we have this nice little freeze guy. But again, I still just haven't used it. Looks like it just stuns everything in the area. But what the hell is that thing up there? Let's go look. This is an open world game after all. We might as well just go from one thing to the next, whatever interests us. So let's go. Hello there. Is there gonna be aliens at this? What is this thing? Is this like a drill or something? Whoa, okay. It's like a drill that's powering this outpost. The force field is still uninterrupted. Hmm. And what difficulty is this little thing here? It doesn't even tell me. Is there a certain way we can turn off the shield is the question. I don't know. I'm gonna break some of these rocks in the area first though. Try to get more upgrades for my movement. So I'm not seeing any specific way to remove this force field quite yet. Maybe a quest will bring us here at some point. But that's wild. Oh, I hear you, Layaz. What's up? An ancient altar? Sure. I cannot get past how stunning this game is, man. Holy shiitakes. Wait, is this going to be another one of those houses with free cool stuff in it for me? Like, what is this thing? Is this some blue crafting supply? What is that? Precious blue flowers. Maybe we can sell that. And there's nothing else in here. Okay. But next I have to head over to this essence shrine over here. I guess it's a place where aliens go after they've become of age to uh, mate. And then that's where they figure out, I guess, their path or their journey or their destiny or something. It's like one of four different essences that are given to them. Kind of reminds me of a bit of like Avatar The Last Airbender, but like it kind of picks their picks their path for them. I don't know. It's kind of kind of different. I like the story of the game so far. More precious flower. Thank you. Ah, they spotted me. Some evil beds. No evil beds. I'll defend the village from the evil birds. So I've roamed over to this lake here, and it says there's an artifact in the water. So, um, is there swimming in this game? Bloop! Okay, it looks like I am kind of swimming. Oh, we can dive. Uh-oh. Okay, where is this creepy artifact? Oh, that looks like a creepy artifact. Do I touch it? Untangle the algae. We're pulling out... Whoa. What the hell? You found it. I found it. What did I find? What is this thing? Oh, I guess we're... Pushing it? What the hell? Bringing it back to the city? What is this thing? Well, I definitely found the artifact. And what do you have to do with it? Hello, buddy. I found this thing. Guess your dad wasn't the nut job people say he was. Here's your artifact. I only wish he could see this. He's, oh, your dad's dead? So, and he was looking for this? I have no clue what this is. That's not good. That makes two of us, but hey, it levitates. That's true. That's a start. Not sure how we can use this to fight the invaders, but let's find out together. It's got to plug into something or use... Bring it to someone smarter than these two. How about that? Okay, so we're going to push this over to the town. Oh, are we going to have to bring these from around the map? I wonder. Oh, 
Oh, nope. There we go. Oh my god. It's probably going to be scattered all around the map. I wonder if this is going to, like, unlock or do for me. Very curious. Slide tackle. Just got to get it to right there, I guess. Boop. Not too close. I found a ball. Room, my friends. What does this ball do? Hey, Robin Hood, lower the bow, okay? I don't take orders from you. You take orders from the chief. Block with magic shield. Calm down. This There's the chief. This piece of trash smells terrible. Why have you brought this here, stranger? I command you to dump it back where you found it at once. Hatso, listen to me, Doc. I, we found the relic Casimir was looking for. Of course, you are behind this, you. Babbling oh my god. This is going to save the village it's a lot the coming invaders, from Jabba the Hutt. Just like the ancients predicted. Nonsense. Do you want to get us all reverted? What? No. There is nothing to see here. Disperse before the invaders spot our gathering from the sky. Hmm. As if your huts and village wouldn't be enough to spot from the sky. That's kind of annoying though. So I, what do I... Move the artifact? They just tied it down. What do I do with it? You and your magic treasure are the talk of the town, Doc. Right? Well, I don't like this. I feel their suspicions. I hope the artifact is safe here. Might be. There are a lot of people in Mia. You think someone would know what this thing is? No I'd hope knows. so. It's too... Wait, Nemeth! He's the oldest Talon in town. Talon is the uh, many scrolls. aliens, Even by the way. The they have a little glossary that you can pop Maybe up. He has a clue. Could you please talk to him? To help you remember what certain things are. It's actually really nice. People are getting too curious, especially Azan. Okay, so we gotta go talk to the shaman. See what he Until thinks about this weird orb we just discovered was. That they have tied down in the middle of the town now. Hello, sir. Do you know about this weird orb that you're staring at? Hello, Shamaz Nemet. You return. Didn't mean to offend you, Nemet. The reason I ask is this thing we dredged up from the lake, it seems really old. Like, ancient. I thought a guy with your experience... <laughs> your experience? Uh, you're old as shit. Or something. What is this rock and what does it do? I recall no description of such an object. Oh, great. Your best chance would be to ask a scholar at the Dano Library. Yeah, I think I lost my library card. Can I borrow yours? Oh my goodness. Uh, a joke. Was it funny? Forgive me for not laughing. Humor harms the purity of the essence. What the hell? We're not allowed to laugh? So we gotta go to a library now and talk to some dude library. that knows what this Question. ball is? Does it still exist? Was the Dano library totally destroyed with the bombing of Procreana? Uh-oh. Or does just a sliver still remain? You should go and find out. So the library got attacked. Great. We gotta go find out what happened. So we gotta teleport over to Procuriana Falls. It looks like we're unlocking a new area just by doing this random little quest line that I found, which is super cool. Out of the portal we come. Where's my alien contact? Hello, lady. Ulukai, there she is. It. Hello. Can you tell How me stuff you about this on? ball? It's the strangest thing. Remember where my Dolatai got abducted the moon we met? Mm hmm. I found a Dioka cord that exact oh. location. Almost as if some. Cores open these portals. Us. And I guess that she found one. Saw. The old librarian. You should find him at what's left of the Dano Library. That's the. Oh my goodness. Look at the Dano Library. It looks like there's enough left. I've only met him once. After the bombing. Good luck talking to him. And he's going to be able to tell me what's going on with that ball. I guess. Why would I need luck? <laughs> You'll see. Uh oh. See annoying? But like we're already in a new area. It looks snowy and mountainous here. Not compared to the, the jungle and plains. It'd be really nice to be able to fly around here though, wouldn't it? Oh, and it's like kind of like a fall biome down there. We gotta go up to the library first, but also part of me wants to just go fight some stuff real quick too. Get some more upgrades. 
Oh gosh. Look at this biome though, man. This is some expansiveness to this map. As you can tell. Oh, there's some different materials here too? What's that gonna be? A precious ore? I think we can sell that in town probably. More healing supplies. Might as well pop one, grab one. Oh gosh, what's attacking me now? Ooh. Some like hyenas or something. Ooh, they drop meat. Don't mind if I do. Oh gosh, that's a blue one. Okay, melee only? Yep, blue ones are melee only. They dropped a little precious ore as well. All right, I think we're good. Maybe not. Oh, that's the wrong way. I think I hit it anyway. Nope, there we go. All right, just keep grabbing their materials and keep on moving. Seems to be another protected base over here. I don't know how to close the shields yet. Hopefully they teach me sooner rather than later. Because I bet the big shielded bases are gonna have the best upgrades. Oh my God. This one's summoning a lot of flying type monsters. A lot of birds. Okay, we just gotta kill 10 of them. Nice. Oh god. Dog on me? Nope. Yep. Here we go. And I think we're good to go. That was one of the easier ones, it seems like. Nice. Could be useful later on. There we go. We got another Gork. There's a Talon over here I wanna scoop up. Don't mind if I do. Okay. And now let's head up to the crazy library. I'm curious about this person they were talking about. They said good luck with him. Not sure what that's supposed to mean. Oh, we're getting a little bit of weather up here. Into the snow for the first time. Beautiful up here. Oh, it's one of those birds that she's flying, maybe? Kinda looks like one. This place has seen better days. I'd say so. Oh, wow, there's a bunch of people living here? Is that a traitor right there? Hello. What does this guy do? I don't know. What do you got? Trade? Oh, he is a trader. Okay, so this is where we can sell stuff. Sell. Valuable items. Sell for money. Sell for money. Sell for money. And then buy. We can buy stingers, meat, and talons. I see. Spiky singer drop on death. It can be used as a crafting resource. Okay. Oh, uh, looks like there's actually a broken portal up there. This game, I just keep saying it, it's stunning. I just want to explore everything. I wonder if there's anything, like, underwater in here? Because now that we know we can dive, I bet there's even more, like, secret tunnels and things. Maybe that's a way. Oh, it's a little Jar Jar Binks baby boy. Hi. Oh, goodbye. I guess we need to go talk to this dude up here. Why do I feel like he's going to be super sassy? Maybe he doesn't even speak? I don't know. What do you do? You... Upgrade inventory. Ooh. So this is how we would upgrade our inventory limits for certain items if we get a little too full. Like potions and things like that. Alright, so that's a lot of crafting, it seems like. And then up here is the man we're looking for. Hello? I do not have a Doka core for this, although it would be really nice to have one. Because I'm assuming I'm going to have to come back here quite often to talk to this guy. A little crafting talon statuette. Hello there, librarian. I'm here to talk, to, talk you. to you. Are you returning a scroll? If you're late, it's going to cost Oh my you. gosh. It's surprising to meet a librarian. A sassy a librarian. Librarian? Yours? No. I'm Professor Curing, the librarian. If you want to continue this conversation, the Dana Library accepts donations. Oh my god. I have to bribe him? No, no, no. I don't need more eggs. What is going you. on? Okay. So he's senile. That's why they said yes? good luck. Yes. Okay. Hallelujah. What? Let's go. Go? Where's oh my you? god. So he has dementia. Is that what this is? So I need to repair the portal, clearly. 
And there's an outpost that's currently holding it, according to the map. Which is that exclamation point right there. Looks like it's... It's gonna be a rough one. Up the road, off to the side there. Let's go check it out. Ah, there it is. So they just built right there? What's this guy? Can I do something with this thing? Ooh, free stuff! Is it the blue crafting supplies? Oh, hell yeah. That blue palladium is one of the main upgrades for my skill trees, so I'm down for that. There is a bunch of enemies right there. Holy crap. Um, I'm going to try to get the high ground, Anakin. That might be the way to go. Hello. We're getting some crits now, which is nice, though. Don't let it overheat, or it's going to use materials. Um, going up. High ground. There we go. This is the highest high ground I could possibly find. Oh god, that's like a Mega Man. That's a different type of enemy. A Vanguard. All out of Halladium for this weapon. Oh god. So we're running low on ammo. Is this... Is any of this Halladium? Got some nano cells off of that guy. That was some palladium. Okay, so that's what we're using for ammo, it seems like. Ooh, more goodies. Don't mind if I do. Give me this. Give me this. More nano cells. Seems like we have an upgrade to release nano mines on taking damage. Which is pretty crazy. There's something to hack right here. I don't know what this does, but I'm gonna do it. Oh, this is where the Doka core is. Okay. Is there another... Uh, yep. A little floating guy, give me some ammo. Can we block that? Okay. We can kind of block it, but it breaks our shield temporarily. Give me all this goodies, thank you. Aha, we unlocked enough nano cells for our next type of skill tree. So it looks like we can improve armor or more damage before sh breaking. I'm thinking just... A general increase of armor would be a good idea. Since more of a... I'm a dodger more than a shielder. But the core should be in here. I'm gonna grab that. And I'm 25 blue essence off... ...of being able to glide, which I am extremely excited for, because there's a lot of height on this map. And I would seriously enjoy being able to glide between objectives. All right, and then we can put the Dokla core in here, which is going to open the portal. Come on, creepy portal. Time to open. It's like damage, though. It still works. Boom. Good to go. And then I got to grab the senile old man and tell him that he doesn't have to walk. Get a little bit of information every time we open up a portal. This is the lady that's the son of the evil leader. You keep sneaking out. Who's My trying to make peace with the aliens? Today. Four. Just because they instead of killing them all. That damn island. She's trying her best to keep the peace, but I really want to steal that ship. Cause that looks cool as heck. Heading down to where we are. All right, now we go grab the old man. Hello, old man. Come with me. I want you to check what the you heck this I orb have is. Before. We have. Thank you. I need your help. Can you come to Amiya with Please me? come with me. What's the secret code? A code? Oh my god. Why did I think this would be easy? If you don't know the code, I have nothing to say to you. Really? If you do, speak now. But be aware that there won't be any second chance. What? A wrong password will seal my lips forever. <sighs> can I get a hint? No, I can't sprint. I'm so <laughs> old that I can barely walk. Okay, bud. But I'll give you a hint. Oh my god. You can find the secret code in an ancient scroll titled The Lost Art of Asking, Asking Things, things Polite. Politely. Oh, it's please. Can you come to with me? Oh my god. Please? Goodbye. Lead the way. Really? What a sassy little asshole. I like him. Here we are. 
All this for a little side quest thing that I randomly did. That's crazy. This probably leads on, like, a long set of side quests where maybe we need to uncover these all over the map. Okay, what is it? Tell me. I'm curious. What, what's growing on it? Ew. Is this thing going to explode? No, it's not mold. These are just plants covering the surface of the egg. Egg? Egg? What kind of monster is in there? Mother, oh God. It's, it's not a mother. It's a baby. The first born Galenta in thousands of cycles. A Galenta? Oh my God! I'm gonna have a baby. Oh my God! It's an egg. Come on, baby critter. Shed that shell already. Okay, Keurig. Professor What's going Keurig? on here? Can What's a Galenta? Galenta? No Talon has ever seen one. Really? The oldest scrolls merely it's like a dragon of some kind? found in the ancient temples, and they are quite abstract. I'm so excited to document the whole incubation hmm. process. Good. Excitement keeps us young and curious. True. How long will it take for the egg to hatch? The process started as soon as the egg entered our warm temperature, but it's not warm enough for hmm. it to proceed. Gotta create an incubation station. I've done this before. So what? Should I sit on it for a few weeks? Nope. We need to quickly raise its internal temperature. Find some covers, like warm blankets that retain heat. Hurry! Okay. Or we could lose the Galenta forever. Is that all? We also need Z dog sap. Okay. Let's well, start with that, buddy. The, sun. the covers and the sap will combine to form a warm cocoon to incubate the egg. All right, we'll go find some sap then. Okay. See you later then. Don't you curse at me. What? I like him. Okay. Where do I find this sap though? That's my question now. Collect some Z-Dog sap. Z-Dogs will only drop sap when they are killed. Oh, Z-Dogs. <gasps> oh, wait. Are those the... The weird noodly guys? Are these Z-Dogs? These are Z-Dogs. It all comes full circle, man. I'm gonna break this real quick. More crafting supplies. Don't mind if I do. Okay, so I gotta farm these guys. A little bit. There we go. Oh, I have to melee them. Oh, gosh. That's not what I want to do. These things are scary as heck. There we go. Come on. Come on, dude. Drop your sap. Damn it. All right, I need five of it. So, like, four shots and a melee. And there we go. And the melee... There we go. Oh, I didn't mean to kill that. Whoopsie. We need one more. And I didn't mean to kill that either. Good thing there's a lot in here. And one melee, please. Bop. All right. We got enough sap. Let's get back to, back to base. All right. I am home. Deposit the Z-Dog sap hey, right not there. Sure how this Z -Dog goo can help, but hey, it says 10 total. We only need five right now, though. I need to go get five more, it looks like. If there's someone on this channel, what the hell? Please come in. Who's talking to me? Who are you? you? Don't remember? We're not exactly friends. Is this the leader? I think he's a bad guy. Yes, that's one way to put it. Yes, I'm with the WFA. Hmm. But I disagree with our general's leadership. And that's supposed to trust you. We got some traitors within the human race. I do like better weapons. My boots are killing me. That's sarcasm you can't fake. Commander Cutter Slade. No. In the flesh. He remembers me from something. Or something. Unbelievable. This is a game changer. I, I'll be in 
Who is that? Who am I? Yeah. My name's Camilla. Tell her I'm coming home soon. I'm sorry. I can't get involved in your family affairs. Hmm. the coordinates I'm sending you. I deactivated the security system so you can enter the facility. But be quick. I don't know how long it will last. Signing off. But fine, I'll do it. At okay. least tell me how Camilla's doing. You can't answer oh, anything answer about so family much. affairs. He's still listening, though. He just told me the location of another weapon. Ooh, retrieve new gear. We can get, like, an assault rifle or something? That'll be sick. I need to put more sap right here. Just deposit 10 sap. Boom. And then we talk to him. You look worried, Greg. What's up? We'll discuss that after our urgent matter. I'll be discreet so the kid doesn't hear Something us. wrong with the egg, Craig? He's way too anxious around the egg, and I don't want him to freak out. He's a father, so after all. So urgent. A Galenta mother uses her trunk to eat the parasites that develop on the surface of her egg. Uh. This phenomenon seems to occur after the shell reaches a certain temperature and releases a very specific type of... Too many details. Okay. All I have to know is the egg has parasites and we have no trunk to take care of them. Should I just eat them? What do I do? Tell me. So these bubbles are parasites. I see. So what can we do about it? <laughs> Your tongue is not long enough, but I appreciate the gesture. Tuan, Tuan huh? A Tuan biped animal. Yes. Hmm. And I've said, time is of the essence. You can ask Doc where you can find some Tuan, huh? But do not tell him why. The kid already makes me nervous as it is. Okay, so we need to go find another animal that'll eat the parasites off of it? So cheap. One is not enough. As a matter of fact, so I gotta start capturing animals now. Slow down the propagation, but I heard there was taming in the game, so I'm curious. Pack of to save the egg. Let's go get some Tuanhas then, shall we? So I have to go and head to a really far away village to get the little animals that'll eat the parasites off the egg. But, uh, first... I want to go grab this new weapon. Because this new weapon is obviously going to make it easier for our travels. But this... area, I can't seem to locate it? What is this thing? Is this a portal? A broken portal? What is this? Um, I guess we swim down and grab whatever this is. Module parts. Parts for a weapon module. We can find a full weapon module. Nice! Okay, so we're finding a bunch of parts for modules. That's just randomly there. That's crazy. Okay, and then the base should be dead ahead of me. And there it is. That's the one that should have my new weapon. I'm very excited to try out and see what it's like. Looks like an assault rifle, but maybe it can be upgraded into something like a sniper or something like that, because I would like some range. Yeah. And this could be a trap, because some random person on the enemy side told me where this was, so... Might be no bueno. There we go. Take all of this stuff out. Dodge you. Shoot the explosive bombs behind him. I don't even know if those are going to go off. Need to grab their ammo. As I kill them. Keep scooting and looting. Block that with my shield. Hit you with, uh, with a... Oh, my shield broke so I can't melee. Oh. A turret. That's my first turret I've taken out. Some goodies underneath him. Some more nano cells and things. I think we're getting really, really close to being able to have our glider. Which I'm excited for. A little spider. What the hell? Goodbye, spider. It's just there's always so many more enemies. A lot of these games, sometimes you only get like two or three enemies and you kind of get 
sick of fighting them, but they just keep introducing more enemies to me. Left and right. What the hell is this? Is this a nuclear missile? Oh gosh, oh gosh. Oh gosh, what is... Stop it, stop it. What in the hell? Do they keep respawning? I think I'm gonna have to like hack them or something. At the top, maybe. I want to grab what's in this first, though. Yeah. I think we're going to have to get to the top to, like, disable these or something. They just break and regenerate. As I was saying, new enemies. They're sending even more new enemies after me. Is that it right there? Oh, that must be the spawner. I think that was the spawner I just broke. Nope. They're still coming. Another one at the top. Here we go. Are we good now? I think we're good now. And look, a blue crate. Super rare. What's it gonna be? Ooh. Don't mind me. That's not good. I'm not going anywhere. Slayed out. I'm gonna have to fight the general? There he is. Evil boy. I know you. You're the problem. I think I worked for him in a previous life. I I saw you die. Well, you know the saying. What doesn't kill you makes you Nope. Well. There goes that. Do I lose my gun now? I should respawn, though, because I have, like, the power of the yods on my side. Damn yep. It. Not again. Time to respawn again. No one's used to leave you enough time to finish. How do you plead? Not plead? Everyone but me was lost so every time we teleport or die, we get more of our backstory on Commander Slade. Instead, you abandoned them and only secured transport for yourself. There was no one left to save except you guys on Earth. And that's exactly what I did. Uh oh. The jury has found you guilty of all charges. The sentence War crimes? Is death by firing squad. General, take the deserter to execution. That's not good. You're making a terrible mistake. I saved all of you. Raise weapons. Oh. Aim. So clearly, I did something you incorrect. Can't pull the trigger yourself. You're a coward, Jack. For Marion. Fire! And here we are, respawning on a portal again. Oh, we kept our weapon, though. This rifle consumes that red stuff we've been picking up. Gotcha. And now if we go in here, we have a few more upgrades, and then see, we have the assault rifle. So, Haladium used, cooling speed, more recoil. And then we can add bonuses onto this, and then cool. you can see it slowly changing as time goes on. And look at this thing. Oh yeah, it kind of is like a... It's, it's like a charge rifle. Ooh, nice. So yeah, it's a bit of a sniper of some kind, kind of. So now we have like the SMG sniper rifle wombo combo. And I need to go to Bidya in order to uh, grab the creature that's going to eat the parasites. Off of the egg over here. But this is where I'm going to wrap up today, guys. There is a lot to this game, and honestly, I highly recommend it if you're looking for a good, solid story. A lot of open-world exploration, tons of side quests and curiosities, and I feel like I'm kind of sucked into it a little bit, and I'm very curious where the story is going to end up. If you guys made it this far, obviously, you enjoy my videos. And you should... Subscribe... Hit the notification icon, make sure it's set to always. And of course, hit the like down below. I will see you guys tomorrow with another video. Adios.